Uh, hello guys, welcome back to Dennis playing on the mains. Uh, today I was thinking about doing two, two things. Uh, one is we need to get it inside of here again. Uh, so we're gonna get these guys. Then we're gonna go down here, getting this back. Yeah. And um, we're gonna jump in here. And we're gonna fetch these guys, right? Because what I wanna do is I wanna make. Uh, let's see. I think it's like that, and I think it's like that. There we go. Nope. I forgot to first make the red color. Uh, sorry about that. Rookie mistake, which I'm supposed to not be. And there we go. Nice. Um, then we're going to go ahead and um, place these guys. Because I want to have a concrete red floor in this hallway. So that is exactly what we're going to go for. Well, uh, these two actually need to be watered before we place them. Uh, so I think we do here. And then we're just going to go across like this and just place this down. Um, we should probably also have... bit more fences around here because these are supposed to these guys go all the way down as they're supposed to but these don't you know so that we need to get fixed as well oh not there sorry my bad and that was all of them okay good and good enough for now uh, let's see, do we have any buckets up here? We do. Nice. So we can just run over here and get some water, like so. And just water all of these. I didn't fetch water? I thought I did. Uh, okay. Lag. Thank you. That was almost all of them. There we go. Okay. Then we're just gonna go ahead and start from in here and work our way out. Like this. Then we're gonna go ahead and make a couple more uh, of this. Uh, so it's gonna be like that, and like that, and like... I keep on forgetting to make the die first. That's not good. There, and there, and there, and voila. Such niceness. I hope this is gonna look as clean as I am hoping because I want I want the floor at least to be a bit clean. Um, there we go. I think that's all of them. Or at least most most of them. Then we're gonna go ahead and um, get out these three gonna exchange these for these and we're gonna place that there, that there, and that there. Then we're just gonna go ahead and do the same here and here. There, that should be enough, I hope. Um, so there and there, there, and yeah, that's, that's it. Then we can go ahead and place the rest of these guys right here and right here. 
Then we're going to go with these two. Um, actually, we're going to go like this. And these two. And place there and there and there and there. That's better. Got a red floor here. That's awesome. Don't lie. Thank you. And seeing as it's nighttime, we are gonna take a nap. Then we're gonna go ahead and do another thing that I want to do this episode, which is I want to start the sheep farm. Right? That's the second time I've done that mistake. I'm just gonna go ahead and grab that. So, how I want to have the sheep farm is I want to start off by uh, taking that down these two trees. So, I'm going to do that on the right back. Okay, I have taken down the trees so we can start doing what I wanted to do this episode. Uh, I'm just going to remove these guys and there we go. The reason why these guys were up is because uh, I have off camera been trying to work a little bit. And as you might have noticed earlier, my shovel now has silk touch on it, on it as well. Uh, I spent a lot of time down in the um, uh, uh, spawner, in the experience points farm, EXP farm, and um, yeah, and I got. About 60 levels, uh, which I used to mend and uh, not mend, but um, make myself a new armor, which I'm wearing right now. Uh, I didn't make it, I just repaired it as best as I could, and uh, so that we could use the diamond armor against the dragon in the future. Um, we got six saplings. We didn't get any more? Okay. So what I want to do here is right here on the side of this, I think I want to have a three, a three wide, wide stair, and it's going to go like that. Just down here, I think that I want to have my sheep farm. So it's gonna be one more, I suppose. And then we can, I think we're gonna go a little bit more down. There. and like so then I think one more because then I'm thinking that this is going to be a little turning point there. So we're going to go down to here, like so, and then we're going to turn and go a few staircases down here, right? Although this might be a little bit taller than I imagined. That's okay. There, one, two, three, four. So one, two, three, four. 
that's as deep as we're gonna go, I think, for this one farm. And all the materials here is gonna be changed out, so... I think we're gonna go with spruce wood. Alright. That's not too bad, is it? I think we're actually gonna go with this height. There. Then we're gonna need... Wait, wait, where? Ah, uh, that's right. My torches is down in the spawner. Okay. Okay, we are back, and I think I'm just going to measure out the room, and we can fill it up together. So we will be right back. Again, I just wanted you guys to know that. Okay, we are back, and I've put up a little wall right here. Just kind of uh, let myself know that this is another type of building inside this base. Uh, and uh, we're gonna put up some walls uh, around here as well and have this as our entrance, but uh, that's gonna come later. Now, let's go and take a look at the room I've set up downstairs. Uh, I haven't really decorated it yet, uh, but what I'm thinking is I'm going to have uh, slabs going on top of here, like so, and I'm gonna remove the walls here and replace them with another type of material, but I'm not quite sure what type of, type of material I want to use here. Um, but what I am thinking is right here, we're going to remove this and replace it with one of that. And then we're going to do that every fourth, I think. So it's going to be one, two, three, four, there. 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 And one, two, three, four. There. Which means I need to remove this wall here, uh, having it one block uh, longer. And that's not the worst thing that could happen. And let's see right there. Okay. That is because I want to be able to kind of. Uh, See how the room is gonna be, sort of. There we go. Okay. So I'm gonna fix this, and we will be right back. Okay, we are back, and uh, I've done a few changes here. Look at this. I finally finished this little road down here, and I finished the other side of the store. Uh, excuse me, of the storage area, except for one small piece, uh, which we are going to fill in right now, real quick. Just gonna go like this. I completely forgot about the floor here, and then we will take it and take a look at the sheep area. We're gonna be getting, or once we have enough sheep, it's gonna be lots and lots of sheep. I'm gonna, I have one pen for every color right now. So that is pretty awesome in my opinion. Uh, so the only thing we need to do is get all the colors and uh, get some more sheep. And it should be pretty easy from there to fill up the area. So let's take a little look down here. And look at this, huh? Isn't this awesome? 
I think it's really good. Well, except for this side right here, but this is basically how it's going to look here. And uh, these guys are actually filled up on wool, so we can go ahead and share them. So that's pretty cool. I think this is pretty, pretty good. Um, now I am going to add a bit more detail around here. But uh, for now, I just wanted to show you guys because I've been working quite a lot on this uh, room. And I really like it, so uh, I hope you guys are gonna like it too. And I need to take a look at how long we have been recording. We've been recording for 17 minutes right now. Um, and I've done quite a lot uh, so far in this episode. Uh, so we're gonna take this down and we're gonna place it right here instead. And uh, we're gonna continue to build the wall around here, I think. Uh, so that we can get this area nice and secluded, so to speak. Not secluded, but protected from creepers and mobs who might spawn around here. Uh, so first off, we're going to get up here and finish that part right there. Which should be fairly easy, like so. Then, I think we're gonna go... This guy needs to be moved. That's n that's not a problem. I'm just gonna go ahead and place him right here. Let's see there. There. Then we can continue on the wall here. Um, so what I'm thinking is we're gonna have it going to right here and right here, I think. That. Oh, that works. Nice. And I can talk about a little thing that I've been thinking about the last few days, uh, which is the Wells Knight Patreon server series, why I haven't made any progress there, uh, and to the others who play there, why I haven't been online at all. And that is because my internet is really bad. Well, not really bad, but bad enough that I can't, um, can't really play there. Uh, so I just can't stay logged in uh, for a long amount of time and it gets really laggy when I'm there. And it's just, it's no fun playing like that. So I've just kind of decided not to play there. Um, yeah, because getting frustrated instead of being able to enjoy the game, no fun, you know. So that's why I haven't done anything there, why I haven't been logged on there, because it just doesn't work for me to be there. I'm sorry. Uh, I really want to, but... Sadly, I can't. Uh, I've been testing out on my own private server, and I can stay logged in perfectly fine there. Uh, so I'm... I suppose it's the location of the server. Like, maybe the patron server is located in America, most likely. And uh, I'm getting a very low ping. So I can't really stay live in there. Um, I don't know if it makes makes sense. It, it does in my head. Um, that's the only explanation I have at least for why I can't stay logged in there. That the servers simply have to be located somewhere else. Because uh, my own private server is located in Amsterdam. And I don't have any trouble logging in there, so... Yeah, that's just my guess, at least, that... It's not just purely my internet's fault, it's also uh, the server location. 
and uh, that's the walls. We did it. What I also want to do here is I want to add a floor. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and um, we're gonna throw these guys in here and we're gonna get these guys out and we're gonna have spruce floor. Because the stairs here is spruce and I want it to kind of make sense in that matter. Let's see. Easy, that's it. Yo! I'm so pleased with having a uh, silk touch on my shovel makes getting grass blocks so much easier. And now we can also get Popsil, um, which actually is a block that I really love to use in buildings. So that is great. Let's see, 60 plus 62. So if we go ahead and do this, there. That should be more than enough. And obviously we're gonna do what we have done in the other room and kind of uh, spice this a little bit up with um, a little bit of dirt, but this time we're not gonna just be using dirt or coarse dirt, we're also gonna be using Popsil because we can, you know. Ah, oh, that was perfect. I didn't miss anything. No. Okay, good. Let's uh, let's go and get some Popsil and coarse dirt. Uh, that's actually this way. That's awesome. Uh, I'm, I don't know if this is going to be a much longer episode when, once we have finished the floor. Uh, because there's other type of projects I want to get into. And uh, that's kind of hard when I'm all focused on building. Uh, I've been kind of hunting for Enderman. There's one. There is actually one guy. So I've been kind of hunting for those because Ender Pearls, I want to get to the end. Uh, but for some reason in my world, it's really hard to find monsters at all. So um, that's why I haven't gotten to the end yet. I guess monsters spawn so rarely here for some reason. I don't know why. Like they spawn, but they spawn slow and usually one at a time, usually it's a zombie or a creeper. <sighs> so that's fun. Let's remove this tree right here. Uh, I'm going to remove a few trees and we'll be right back. Okay, a few trees has been removed. We are going to continue on getting these guys. That this is more than enough, I think. Of course, I'm not 100% sure, but but I think I think that's good. Uh, so we're gonna run back. I love feather fun. Oh. We're gonna try to be as quick as we possibly can, and. Um... get back into our base here and um, start to place these down. Let's see, we can do a little bit here, a little bit here, a little bit here, a little bit right here. Actually not just a little bit right there, but a lot. Uh, here. Maybe not there, but like so. And I 
think that ought to be good. So we're going to go with Course Dirt and Pod Soul. Gotta check the text message. And we can kind of just get these guys in here. We're gonna start with the Course Dirt. Change it out a little bit with console here and there, you know. Uh, and also, we're gonna use a little bit of wood for dirt here as well. Uh, so I think maybe right there, 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 uh, there, 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 there. We're gonna go with a little bit of regular dirt, like this, All right? Then we're gonna go right like so, like so, uh, here, 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 not there, uh, there we go, but there, Oh, keeps doing that on me. I don't know why. And here, and there we go. That's it. That's it. I think. I think that's fair enough. Uh, let's get some lights up on the walls here because. So uh, rather dark. And then we're gonna go down here again and we're gonna play some lights and then we'll be right back. Okay, we are back and we have placed placed down the torches. And I think this looks really good. I, I like this. I like that one. I like it a lot. Uh, so I think that's it for today. Um, Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, don't forget to uh, hit that like and subscribe button if you did enjoy this uh, episode. And don't forget to leave a comment if you want to see something something a bit different from time to time. And um, I hope that you're going to have a good day on. Okay. Bye-bye.